so this is how the first cut looks like so this second cut I flipped the wood over so it's cutting very close to my marked line so all this part would be cut out and removed so this is the front and I cut maybe I'm going to cut up to here this is the part that has to be removed and you are left with maybe like half an inch taper down all the way the reverse side I have cut pretty much already but I would have to use a rasp to file it down all the way to this black line here which is so I'm gonna remove more of the wood closer to the root So I'm getting there, I had to use my reciprocating saw to cut the bit over here and then the whole piece came off. So this is how it looks, about 3 degrees. I have to take a lot more off over here. So this piece of wood is much lighter already with a lot of the wood so not I use this reciprocating saw to rough cut this part. This part is the curve and you can see the marks or the cut is very close to the line. I think at one point over here it just nicked the line and it's kind of scary because when the reciprocating saw is going fast you don't know how deep it is cutting. Wrong, one wrong move and you're done. So on this side here is cut to this line. The rest of these have to be trimmed down to this line also. So I have to knock out these and then smooth out the whole thing. And then same thing with the other side. So this is the job for the day, I'm pretty much done, looking good, no major accident yet. We'll continue tomorrow.